and death may hit home. Nobody ever expects that. Especially when it happens all of a sudden. Catches you off guard. I got up one morning, went out to the truck, and I had a load of money that was in a bank bag under the seat. I'd left it out there that night, forgot to bring it in. First thing I done when I got in the truck, Randy, I reached down, I felt that bag. Oh, thank God. <laughs> and all of a sudden, I realized it was unzipped. I said, oh my God. I poured it out when I did, I realized it was empty. Had $6,500 in it. It was gone. What my money, Randy? Caught me by surprise. I, I, I lost it. I'm not proud of that, but I did, I lost it. Went running in the house, Sandra, wake her up. I mean, I guess that's the first time she ever really seen me trip out, amen, I was tripping out. Went out and I was accusing everybody and anybody I could think of. Then was like, Derek, calm down. You need to pray. I said, I don't want to pray. Why, my flesh was overruling my spirit, man, because I was worried. Maybe you're one that worries. Let me just tell you, Jesus is here to help you too. Yes, but you got to run to him. you got to run to him. Kneel down to him with all your heart. Say, Lord, help me. I don't know what to do. I'm doing all I know to do, but God, I need you to guide me. I need you to lead God and direct me to help me to make the right choices. And I promise you this, amen, he'll not let you down. How do you know that, Brother Derek? Because his word says if you'll come to God with a broken heart and a contrite spirit, in no wise shall he turn you away. His book is a book of promises. All you gotta do is cry out to him with all your heart. Maybe you're one in here and you fight with a spirit of anxiety. Something don't go the way you think it ought to, you kind of lose it. You know, these spirits that we wrestle with are sent from the enemy to knock us off course. But his book is a book of promises. Yes. It's to keep us in line. It's to help us to walk down the straight and narrow. But if we don't humble ourselves and we allow these spirits to continue in our life we may veer off that path of righteousness so far and Jesus come back and we miss heaven to be our home I don't want anybody in here to do that I'm like brother Ken I want to see everybody in heaven amen but you know I can't do it for you you can't do it for me. It's going to take God. It's going to take God. He's an all-powerful God. Yes, He is. While He's praying, I want to read this to you real quickly. A promise is valuable. Only if the one making it has true 
trustworthy, a trustworthy character and the ability to carry it through. Promise ain't no good if it's somebody that's not honest, not faithful, not loving. a bit of good but the promises that God makes it'll bring you through he'll always show up right on time he's always there to carry you through even when it looks like it's too difficult and you're not going to make it he can still take you through. Amen. He's a good God. He loves you tonight. Amen. He's here tonight to help you. To lead God and direct you. To show you the way. Why? Because he's faithful. You can count on him. Amen. What about you tonight? Amen. there's times that you can't count on me. Not that I wouldn't do what I could because I would. But sometimes I might just not be available. That's the truth. You might try to call me and my, I may be in a dead zone. Can't even get a hold of me. Or I might have forgot my phone. Or maybe the power's done run out of it and it's dead. But for some reason, you wouldn't even be able to get a hold of it. But you can count on God. I don't care where you're at, what you're going through, how difficult it may seem. He can bring you through. Amen. And He'll show up. He won't be a minute late. See, I may be on my way. But I may get there just a little too late, Brother John. But you know what? You call on Him. He's going to show up right on time. And He ain't going to let you down. And you don't have to beg Him. All you got to do is cry out to Him. He's a good God. He's a loving God. He's an all-powerful God. He's truthful. And He's faithful. I hope you got something tonight and realize that if you got a need tonight, all you got to do is look unto Him.